my second outfit change, but I'm kind of having a dilemma. I don't know what shoes I want to go with. But um, I just found this top at Urban Outfitters. It's like a kind of knitted one. It was like in the clearance section. And the black crop top I brought, I didn't really like. So I was like, I'm going to just get that to go. And then um, y'all probably, if you watched my last vlog, you saw that I got these at the Nike store. And so, yeah, we have the shoes that he just got me. And then we have these and ugh. see like how this is like red red but this is like kind of like a maroon pink or something but i don't know i feel like it's not that big of a deal and it just pops better like i'm not really a stickler about matching on matching as long as it's like in the same family and i'm gonna wear my little betsy johnson bag little mini bag yeah i think i'm gonna go with the red but wear a longer sock So we missed the mall. It closed at seven and that's like in 20 minutes. So at that point, there was no point of going. So now we have like an hour and 20 minutes until our um, our little tour. You know, we gotta be there like 15 minutes early. So yeah, we have like an hour 20 until our tour. So now we're trying to see if we can find some wings or something. Cause I've been wanting wings since like yesterday. So hopefully you can find some and hopefully they're busting. Never ever meant to be so sour, baby. Running on a steam every day, be the same. Living like this, testing all my patience. Need a bit of you every time I drink like a love This weight looks like it's a weight We are taking all the L's and like visiting anywhere right now Especially food So we came out here and tried to get some wings And the wait is like 45 minutes And our tour starts in like an hour So we were cool with like just getting our food and like saving it for later But that's not even an option. So clearly the wings are busting. They all want something now. I don't got the time to go in front. See my eyes got money bags. I don't rest. I might be a Nike fiend. I need my checks. Headed for the love light. Ain't just hype. It's not overnight. I take my advice. I'm gonna do this right. Feeling nice. What's the price? Yeah. Do not live in twice. Yeah. My fam on my spine, yeah. Dream be getting sliced like a lime. I never ever meant to be so sour, baby. Running out of steam every day, be the same. Living like this, testing all my patience. Need a bit of you every time. Very close. So Another L. What are we eating now? All right, y'all. So we finally, finally found some food. But the one time we finally find food, we go to this chicken place right here. Tell me why this chicken place is right across the street. Yes, the one with all the booming music. But the reason we didn't go is because we thought they didn't have wings. And he just looked online and they had wings. And hey, they had I bet, daiquiris. I bet this place be better though. You think so? Yeah, this is a franchise. I guess. This one, this one. Are the daiquiris available though? We're going to find out. That's the only reason I care to go there. Alright, we got to go. I guess I'll do this now and research later. Oh, you got watermelon or no, you got down home punch. Oh, 
Charles. Yeah, are you okay? You need a Cuban link. just went on um would you say it was scary at all nah you could have watched that on youtube yeah it wasn't scary at all uh, i'm not even sure i don't think i chose the scary scary one i'll put like the title of what it was called i mean they had some interesting stuff but it was kind of yeah. like a history lesson kind of yeah. but like a dark history lesson but the most interesting thing was probably this one building that if you walk under the balcony apparently everybody who's ever walked under it has been cursed and our tour guide did not walk us under that side we just talked about it across the street but we did see a few people walk underneath that balcony and he told us some crazy but true stories about people who did but yeah it was it was cool it was straight or whatever but now we're about to uh, we're we gonna go back to the airbnb and eat yeah yeah we're about to go eat because these wings <laughs> these wings have been sitting in the car and they're cold now so we're probably just about to you know, put them in the oven, run them through, because we... Did you see the sign? No, what the sign say? It said need weed money. Need weed money. Weed. Oh, oh, weed money. At least he's honest. <laughs> yeah, we're about to go back to the hotel, eat these wings, and he wants to go... To the casino. To the casino. Play some blackjack. And I probably will want to be asleep. <laughs> oh my. Got the wing. Is that the place you thought it wasn't gonna be good, y'all? I didn't say that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> good morning, you guys. It is Saturday, so it's our last day. And so I just got like out the shower and dressed and stuff. I'm not even wearing what I intended to wear. I intended to be like really cutesy and. I don't know and I just I don't feel like it I'm gonna do my makeup but I'm not doing like my full face makeup like I'm not wearing eyeliner and concealer and all that really just foundation and eyebrows and stuff because eyebrows are essential for me but I'm um, definitely wearing my sunscreen and uh, this is the Milani prime and protect I wear this because it is literally primer and a sunscreen and your girl loves a two-in-one like i like makeup but i'm not like a i don't get excited about makeup maybe because i'm not good at it i think that's why you know you don't tend to get excited about things you're not necessarily good at. i feel like i look dead without foundation it kind of gives me like a little bronzy look but then again also if i wear foundation and don't put bronzer on i also look dead so Maybe I'm just dead, I don't know. My eyebrow is doing some crazy things right now. I mean, it always is, but it's like a box. <laughs> I kind of, like I, I give up. I don't feel like fixing it. Whatever. All right, so getting ready to go. We literally have two minutes before we're supposed to leave. But this is what I decided to wear. It's just something I just had in my bag. So I've got the same Jordans on, some little split seam jeans, a shoestring, little bra, white top, and Louis. That's it. <laughs> so the plan is to, I guess, go thrifting. I kind of want to see what that one shopping mall had, the one that we didn't get to make it to and definitely eat something. I'm not really hungry right now, so I might just wait, but I really don't even know what I want at all. I'm not in a brunch mood because we had like a really bomb brunch yesterday and brunch just fills me up like way too much. <laughs> so I really want like some legit lunch, but I really don't know what to get because we already tried the Cajun food and all of that, so.
All right, so we just came out of guess. I had to stop filming because you can't film and guess, but honestly, y'all didn't miss much. Probably just gonna go thrifting next after I eat, because this is starving. So we're gonna go to the Croc store. Um, I haven't had Crocs since I was in elementary school, but I was thinking it'd be a good idea for to wear to work. So let's see what they have. Hopefully they let me film. <laughs> oh, they, hi. They got white. White looks like hospital shoes or something. But can you guess which ones that I'm most drawn to? Can you guess? <laughs> He's guessing which ones that I like. Which ones did you say? It's the camo ones. Those things fire. But I probably wouldn't get those because they wouldn't go with anything. Well, not anything, but they wouldn't go with a lot. Got some Harry Potter ones, but they got the little Harry Potter thingies in them but I think I have to buy those separate I'm really bad at making decisions like I like I suck at making decisions on the spot all right so there's the orange one and there's the green what do you think which one Let's see. I'm trying to think which ones these charms will look better on I feel like these orange ones are more fun. I think I want the orange ones. I like that they're ones. like pastel y, you know? Yeah. Like the yellow charm and stuff will look good with them. I got a peace yeah. sign, you guys, and a J. If you didn't know what the J was for, it's for Jordan. <laughs> so we are here at the, you said Blue House? Bridge House. Bridge House. I keep calling it that. Bridge House uh, thrift store in New Orleans. Oh, hold on. I gotta get my mask. Huh? I gotta get my mask. This boy came out here with no mask. Like it ain't in the middle of 2020. <laughs> Let's see what they got. Oh, my underwear out there. You see my undies? Yeah. Am I creasing my shoes? I like this one. You don't have to like it. Just look. I said you don't have to like it. Just look. Okay, so I really skimmed through the dresses because there was just so many and I didn't feel like going through that and I didn't feel like putting my boyfriend <laughs> through sitting there through that. So we're gonna go ahead and move on. Um, there's really not that many rows in here. Like, 
at all. So at least it's not overwhelming. It's very loud in here though, I will say that. All right, so we dipped out of there because it was, mm, first of all, the clothes were like current and like mid 2000s. And you know, I don't like that. And then second, everything didn't have a price tag less than $20 on it. Like everything. Like all the shoes were like 40, but they were having 50% off the whole store to like, you know, save from the pandemic. But then all the dresses and shirts and things were like 24, uh, 15, 10. I was like, and it was like 10 for like things you wouldn't think would be 10, you know? So like the worst thing in there would be like $10. <laughs> So yeah, we had to get out of there, but I think we're just gonna go eat now and then probably try one more thrift store. I'm not pressed to find anything, honestly. I just wanted to see, you know, how they were while I was here. We can't knock out the other thrift store. You're not hungry yet? Well, I guess we're gonna do the thrift store. Uh, no, not yet. I guess we're gonna do the thrift store next. Y'all, it is jumping in here. First of all, it's humongous. Second of all, it is packed. In the sweatpants area, it's gonna get cold soon. And I'm already looking at these, cause they're bright. <laughs> the prices are already a lot less hurtful. Like these are $6.99. These look comfy. What are they? Oh, dang it. Hmm. Uh, I don't like them uh, anymore. Uh, <laughs> I take it back. <laughs> I'm weak. You got me. Ryan Little. <laughs> Are these not kind of lit? I like these. They're furry oh, oh. and they're zebra print. Ah! Oh, <laughs> oh it's that. Uh, oh, you, you taking a picture, huh? summer stuff for winter and fall. I was asleep for about like 15 minutes. I was a KO. But yeah, we're about to go into the casino and then we're gonna look into getting something to eat. He wants to eat Pie Pies in Louisiana. I really need to ask y'all next time before I like come to y'all city like, hey, give me some suggestions. Because a couple of people gave me some quick ones like on Instagram, but it would've been nice to like have some suggestions like already planned out, you know? But yeah, let's get going so we can hop on the road. Mm -hmm. 